Help you gentlemen? Oh wow, look LAPD at this dude. detectives, Mr. Black. You're under arrest. Look, I'm really sorry about this. I never tried to hurt anyone. I just needed to get away from LA. I won't put up a struggle. Just let me get my things. Fuck no. I knew it! I, I knew it! After him. Bro, I knew it too. The car. Remember, the gun is the last resort. This this is a big guy, so let's see how fast he really is, bro. There's no point running, I should not be chasing after him for so long. What is good YouTube is your boy LSG Melly and I am bringing you guys part two of LA Noir bro we are now a, P a PI a private investigator are we private investigators or are we just detectives I think we're just detectives I don't I think they're the same thing but I don't know this cop logic like that as much lower note as I watch I still don't know the difference sometimes but that's besides the point I hope you guys are really liking this though, for real though. I really think this game didn't get the right love it should have got. Like, this should have been a second game to this. This game was great. We got two Red Dead Redemptions. We got five GTAs. This game was great. We should have got a second, bro. But without further ado, we're about to hop into this thing. If you guys are liking the content, please like and subscribe, turn the notification bell on. I really appreciate that. Stay tuned, y'all. All right, this one is called the driver's seat. Let's see. Yes, sir. Y'all see that suit? Y'all see the suit, bro? We're no longer a police officer. No, no, no. We wear the big boy briefs in this bitch. Nair. Here's I'm your new desk, kid. You're on traffic. The hot sheet is posted here next to the map. What's his problem? That's Biggs. He's an institution. So this is what all the fuss is about. Why couldn't they build a freeway that goes past my place? They haven't even approved the money yet, kid. The bond issue won't be till December. It'll be years before any of this will happen. Here's your new partner, Stefan Burkowski. I've heard all about you, Phelps. You go easy on me and let me earn the odd citation, and maybe we'll get along fine. Hmm. I'm here to learn, detective. <laughs> oh, he's an intense one, isn't he, Mel? He's intense. The newly minted detective here, Cole Phelps. Hi, Phelps. I'll be keeping an eye on you. I could spend a little time basking in reflected glory. Make a change from busting hooks. I don't like this feeds. fucker right here, bro. I don't know why I don't like him. Who was that? Commander? Roy Earl, chief detective and advice. Do they all dress like movie stars? <laughs> Roy is a movie star. <laughs> and the whole of the seedy side of L.A. is his audience. <laughs> what is that supposed to mean? Stick with me, kid. You'll find out. I don't know why I don't like that guy. I just remember it. I don't like him for some reason. And now some housekeeping. Warm Central Division welcome for Detective Cole Phelps. Some of you guys may know Phelps. He's Ew, the cop what, who broke the jewelry No, no, no. I'm going to need a better welcome than that, bro. Have to take a bow, Phelps. If it's all right with That's you, sir. That's an order, Phelps. <laughs> shh, shh, quiet, everybody. Phelps is Yo, one of only two serving bro. LAPD officers who received the Silver Star during the war. You really gave it those lousy Japanese, eh, Phelps? Uh, I did my best, Captain. Why are you war heroes always so modest? I've partnered Phelps <laughs> with everybody's favorite pole. They Stephon want to be Bukowski. like, yeah, we kicked their <laughs> ass. Bukowski sure as hell doesn't. Well, that's why we have partners, right? <laughs> okay, okay, can it, guys. Stick with Bukowski. He's a good cop. He knows traffic inside now. I'm gonna start you out with one case. You do okay? I'll give you a couple more. You screw up, you'll be rousing vagrants and running license plates. Now get down to the PE Freight Depot, 6th and Alameda. A patrolman called in a suspicious vehicle. Signs of foul play. See what you can find out. Come on, Phelps. Yes, sir. That Let's get this shit. At me, I put him down with my sack. All right, let me put him down with your what? 
Did he say put him down with his sack? Bro, I just I just started this game, bro. I just started this game. Pause with that. All right. Dialogue, turn it down just a notch. Yeah. All right, we're good now. Exit to California They really pushed you through quick, didn't they? Six years on patrol before I got this desk. You were here in five minutes. What do you want me to say? I didn't ask for any favors. I guarantee he walked. <laughs> I really didn't. I just, just being, you know just place? being, just being me, bro. Sure. Near the old gas works and signal depot in the warehouse district. Bro, the driving in this game is smooth. I feel like driving in in this in Rockstar games are always smooth. Cause, bro. Tell me a little about yourself, Phelps. Are we friends now? We work together. Don't be so touchy. Grew up in San Francisco. All right, so wait. Before we go to the main mission, we got some shit Stanford, going on over here. Two years ROTC before Reno CS at Camp Elliott. Shipped out in early '45 as a first lieutenant. Fought in the Okinawa campaign. I was wounded. Shipped back home. A year on the beat. Now I'm here. So you won the Silver Star. I don't want to talk about it. Now let me get this straight. You single-handedly killed 40 Japs on this hill in Okinawa. No, you were up there all night, draped in the flag, knife between your teeth, gun at the ready, finished? The Emperor Hirohito himself leading the charge against you. I did my part, Mikhausen. <laughs> what did you do? I kept the streets of LA safe for the people. Yeah, now I get it. Unfit for service. Oh, fuck you, Phelps. I earned a bravery citation during the Zuda riots. Ooh, a oh, bravery citation. Funny. All units of 459 just occurred at 6th and Saras. Any unit to handle, code 2. Bro, this is too many cases, bro. Left King, go ahead, KTPL. This is too many cases, bro. Up on the roof, officer. He has a mask on his face. I caught sight when he shoved past me, but be careful. I saw him waving a gun. Oh, so you want smoke? You think this is some wild, wild west shit? Give it up now. Oh, you're running? Get the hell away from me. Where did he go? Whoa, he's shooting. Yo, he kind of fast. You can still catch him. Bro, this guy is really quick, bro. Is somebody going to tell us what the hell is going on? Yo, yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm so glad y'all stopped. I was supposed to shoot at him. Yeah, because once he started shooting at me, I, I kind of don't even want you alive no more, bro. Oh, he has a gun. Huh? I, I kind of feel bad for killing him, though, but he started shooting at me, bro. All right, street crimes, one out of 40. All right, I'm not gonna lie. Bro, move. Mans would not let me in the car. Why did you want to get on my side? What kind of kinky shit are you on, bro? Like, I, I, we, we don't play those games, pal. I, mean, I don't discriminate, but that's 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 what I do. That's well, what I now you've either got to stop or put your fucking foot down. Oh damn. I'm not gonna get an A anymore. Shit. Oh well. Why are you crossing the street when I'm looking both ways? That's not my fault. Going through. Parking lot straight ahead. I need to get back to work, officer. The detectives are here now. You repeat to them what you told me. I did the right thing by calling this in. 
I'm just a working stick. Just give him your story and you'll be all right. But you shaking in your boots for a boy? I did not mean to call him boy. I do not want to. I'm not racist. This is your first case, Phelps. It's okay to admit it if you're stumped. If you don't Yo. know what to do next. Just come talk to me and we'll see. Bro, I got do. this. Back up. Thanks, Stefan. Watch out. Watch out. Watch you're out. Okay. Watch out. Move around, move around, move around. I got this. Alright. So do I just go do I just go straight to him? You know what? I'm gonna I'm I'm going to the crime scene first. You giving me the hi hat? I'm going to the crime scene first and then I'll talk to this guy. Damn, this blood splatter is crazy. Victim looks to have lost a lot of blood. Okay, we got the blood splatter. What's in the trunk? Can we go in the trunk? Okay, we got a crowbar. Maybe. No. All right, what's this letter? Riverside Slaughterhouse. Morgan picked up a live pig yesterday. A live hog? You got a whole live pig for three dollars and twenty cent? What? I said live hog, not hog. What the hell is going on here? You talk to this guy. Yeah. Detective Phelps. What have we got? A lot of blood for a blunt force injury. The victim must be in a very bad way. Any sign of the guy? Not unless he's in the trunk of the car. The I mean, no. Ah, always the same two of you find. How about you? Yeah, I want to check. I wanted to check this side. I've got a mystery sample waiting at the lab. All right. Where's the body at? I guess. Oh, you got to make sure you go to the yellow tags, because these what the clues be. All right. We have uh Adrian Black. 32 years old, married, sounds like an average guy. What was he doing out here? Catch all the good ones, fellas. Yo, my last name is Black, guys. <laughs> so it's, it's, it's so weird seeing my last name. Um, let me see, was he, he was married? Happier times, I guess. Yep. All right, so we have an Adrian Black. Let's check his glasses. His glasses probably don't mean anything, though. Unless we can find out his prescription. Stain? What? Bro, censor it. Here we go. Stenzel. Stenzel glasses. Home repaired by the look of it. Okay. Don't know what that's supposed to mean. Uh, any more clues? Okay, we got some stuff over here. And this is the object. You touching shit without gloves, bro? Are you good? Insta heat. Brand name might give us something to go on. All right, we got A. All right, B. And then C. I don't think there's anything else. All right, I'm not in the crime scene anymore. All right, we should probably talk to the guy now. Well, let me talk to the officer first. I'm Officer Hart. Phelps, traffic. What have you got? Abandoned car, probably stolen. The solid citizen is Nate Wilkie. He called it in. What gives with the corner? The solid citizen? There's blood all over the interior. Someone's copped a full Broderick, but no stiff as yet. We have an owner for the car? The car is registered to an Adrian Black, just north of Bunker Hill. All right, we'll take a look around. I better get back to work, sir. Use intuition to search for clues.
I mean, we're still in the, uh, we're still in the crime scene area, right? All right, let's, let's talk to this guy. Sir, I'm Detective Phelps. Name's Nate Wilkie. You found the vehicle? Sure. Saw it just sitting there. Strange place to be parking your car. Figured I'd better take a look. And then I saw all the blood. So I called the police. Okay. Purpose at scene. I mean, he looks like he works here, Mind like you said. I ask what you were doing out here? Well, I work for the railway. I was on my way out to the switch and reckon I'd take a shortcut. I believe him. Did you see anybody else in the yard? Maybe somebody hanging around the car? Nope. I hadn't seen a soul all day till you boys turned up. All right, knowledge of Adrian Black. Do you know Adrian Black, Mr. Wilkie? No, sir. That ain't a name I'm familiar with. That sounds like Cap. All right, let's use intuition to get rid of one. Yeah, he's definitely lying. Am I going to have to stand here all day until you tell me the truth? I was going to doubt it, You know it, but... the driver. I'm telling you, I don't know who was driving that car. You can prove it different. All right, let's see. We got the abandoned vehicle. Uh... Huh. Uh, um, is it the glasses? Gun. Oh. oh. They go to your head, son. It's about time you made me an apology. Fuck. Contents of the wallet. wallet. By the car. Was there anything in it when you arrived? I should have did the blood You're accusing me of something, mister? What the hell? Bl wait, bloodstained pipe found, found a steel pipe with blood on it near the car. Do you know anything about it, Mr. Wilkie? No, sir. I went straight for the law when I saw the car was full of blood. I believe him. When you saw the blood, was it wet, bright red, or uh, darker like it is now? Darker, I'd say. Looked dry already. <laughs> Contents of the wallet. The wallet by the car. Was there anything in it when you arrived? You accusing me of something, mister? Why are you looking around like that? Tell the truth, Mr. Wilkie. You rifled the wallet. My money is my money. You can't prove I touched that wallet. Yes, I can. Man does the right thing, oh the police my. try to turn him into a criminal. Don't leave town, Mr. Wilkie. We'll get in touch with your employer if we need anything more from you. I'll let him know why I missed half my shift today. Your boy should learn some gratitude. Bro, I... somebody's got to inform the wife, Phelps. Uh... If you're done here, we'll head over there now. We're going to notify the wife. You seem to have it under control here. Yeah, I got this. Oh man. Nice day for it. I hate when I can't interrogate them properly, bro. I better get back to work, sir. Alright, so we gotta go to his wife. Black residence. <laughs> Six twenty Bunker Hill Avenue. You know where that is? Behind Bunker Hill. A couple blocks north of Central Station. Why would you run into the car so, more? What do we tell the wife? Play it by the book. There's no stiff yet, so let's see how it plays out. I and this officer needs help. 333 South Main Street. 333 South Main Street. Officer needs help. 211 the shots. I'm gonna do right. Get a car theft gone wrong. Make black drive somewhere lonely, then give him a tap. But why leave the car? Well, obviously, someone got a little heavy hand. It's the wrong way around. How so, genius? Where is Adrian? If you've gone to all the trouble to steal the car and it goes wrong, you leave the body behind, not the car. That's <laughs> not 
though. Yeah, he took the body and left the up. car. What the hell? Right, these cops, where y'all at? Did you read about the guy on the crossing yesterday? No, what happened? Over on Lincoln Avenue. This guy's driving along and his oil light comes on. He stops the car and gets out. <laughs> he pops the hood and he's on a rail crossing. Damn. Officer needs help. 333 South Main Street. Bro, I can't. It's, it's too many. It's too many. So much crime, bro. What's the situation? Uh, we got a hold up gun sour. Three guns locked themselves in with two hostages. I tried to go on through the front, but the place is a fortress. I nearly got a mouthful of lead from my trouble. All right. I'll see if I can get in through the back. All right. I'll stay here and keep him busy. Yes, sir. Let's go. Let's go back. Oh, I don't think I did this crime before. All right, let's do this. FBI, open up. Show you, show your face. Let me shot my hat off. Right. Stay down. Stay down. Up the stairs. Get Let's after go. him. Is he going? Is he running? Oh yeah, he's running. Weapon down now. Woo! One bullet needed. Let's get it. Car 11K. I've been involved in a shooting at 333 South Main Street. Globe loan and jewelry. It's code four now, but the suspect is down. I need an ambulance here. I notify my supervisor and the coroner. All right, let me go do the main missions. I don't want to. I don't want to uh, waste you guys' time. All right. What if I like driving backwards, huh? Have you ever thought about that? I don't know why they get out the car for just slightly tapping these shit. But if you really thought I was going to stop and talk to you, yeah, you're bugged out, bro. I got to do better with these damn interrogations, bro. I'm slacking. Like if I'm like, I, like I need to start using the doubt, the doubt option. If I don't have any clues. I need to start using my clues too. Ooh, I almost ran her over. You know, we might get there quicker if you use the siren. You might get there quick. You want to drive? Because uh, 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 you always head your ass to the to the passenger. I, I didn't think I didn't think you wanted to drive. No, I am not doing this. I am not entering no more dispatches. I gotta do the main mission, bro. Or we'll be here all damn day. Open your eyes! <laughs> the black residents. Let's go introduce ourselves. You talk to her, Phelps. I'm no good at this shoulder to cry on stuff. Oh, man. See, I'm doing everything, and I just got here. Just a minute. I'm doing the interrogation. Now I got to tell the wife. I'm doing the shooting. Like. LAPD, Mrs. Black. May we come in? We have some bad news, and we'd rather discuss this in private. I'm Margaret Black. 
Oh, we can discuss this in the living room. Please come in. Oof. Your husband drives a blue Lincoln, Mrs. Black? That's correct. The car has been found abandoned, and I'm afraid there are signs of foul play. I knew something was wrong when he didn't come home. We believe your husband may be injured. We found a pipe on the scene with blood on it. Oh, no! My poor Adrian! You does still ain't... insta-heat mean anything to you, ma'am? Yes, it does. We've just had a new water heater installed. Whereabouts, Mrs. Black? Just outside the kitchen window, at the side of the house. I'd like you to try and stay calm and remember everything that you can about last night. My partner and I are going to take a look around. When you're ready, we're going to have some more questions for you. Is that okay? Of course, officer. Anything to help secure my husband's safety. All right. Well, Investigation. All right, they, look around. they said gotta be something in here to go on. They said outside the kitchen window, right? All right. Well, shit's vibrating already. What the hell? Pliers? I doubt it. Why does it vibrate when it's nothing important? Uh huh. Here we go. No use leaving the thing half finished. What are you about to do helping, bro? What the hell are you helping for? Oh. That can't be right. That's not what I was trying to do. Yeah, that. No. That won't work. That's what I was trying to do. And we got this. Sir. All right, so maybe it's over here. And then the one missing. Oh, the one that was used in the in the uh with the foul play. That's that's the one that's missing. So the pipe missing from Mr. Black's heater is the same one that killed him. Huh. Seems like the assailant is a little closer to home. Yeah, that's kind of that's kind of suspect. Huh. Was there? Did they have a good marriage? I don't know. I start look. I will start looking at the wife a little different. You feel me? Oh shit! What is this? A basket of flowers? That shit don't mean nothing. Why are you vibrating then? All right, I'm outside of the. Uh... As long as I still hear music, I'm gonna say everything is a part of the crime scene. Everywhere I can go. All right, we got that. All right, we got the main thing. So now it's time to search. Nope, I don't have any questions for you right now. Search the bedroom. Who's this? That's her. Is this important? Right. This seems to be is this their room? Oh closet. Alright, nothing. Okay, any other rooms? Was this cigarettes they smoked? Cavanaugh's. So who brought this home? Cavanaugh's. Yep. Los Maybe Angeles. Adrian's a patron. R and I should have an address. R and I records in uh okay so we got a place to go all right so we need a phone wait there's a lot of stuff in here though a train ticket somebody was about to leave a used ticket to Seattle and a suitcase gone missing someone couldn't wait to get out of this house oh I don't think they had a. It was everything ain't peachy in the house. Are these separate rooms? Oh, the this glasses. Open it. Those could be the glasses that were missing. Ah. Just 
Fenzel. Uh -huh. so the glasses are a match. Uh, okay, okay, okay. Yeah, we got we getting there, we getting there, we getting there. Separate bedrooms, separate pictures. I will see marriage ain't ma marriage ain't peachy, bro. The marriage ain't peachy, man. To my Adrian. To my Adrian. Love sick like and lonely without you. Hurry back, my darling, Nicole. Oh, Nicole don't sound like his wife. Wow. So they were married. They were probably on the verge of a divorce, I think. They have separate bedrooms. He's he has another lover. That's probably what the train ticket was for. That's probably where he went with the suitcase. Oh, this is spicy. This is spicy. This is iron hot, bro. Um, I need the phone though. There we go. Operator, give me R and I. Putting you through now. Phelps, one two four seven. How could I help, Detective? I need an address on a Kavanaugh's bar. Certainly, Detective. One moment. Kavanaugh's Bar, corner of Aliso and Hewitt, south side of Union Station. Thank you. Okay, we got an address. Kavanaugh's Bar. I'm all uh, right. No. Uh, I don't know if I'm ready to talk to her yet. Let's let, yeah, let's check the kitchen. Ooh, no, we have something right here. What's this? What's this? Newspaper. I'm not looking at that shit, bro. All right, so we know that they smoked. All right. They want me to look at this damn newspaper so bad, bro. I'm not looking at that shit. All right, dude, those matchbooks are everywhere. What the hell? Iron? Oxidol? Doesn't tell me anything. Okay, and then we got our iron. These aren't nothing important. Significant. Nah, you're right, you're right. This, this ain't nothing. Um. Okay, so there's nothing in here. I feel like I got everything. Walking throughout this whole house. Oh, what's this? Oh, wait, no, we're not done yet. Okay, we got a insta heat ad. They cannot, they cannot rush to corrode. Yeah, this is a, this is a receipt of a in the flyer. House bought this unit, knowing how they would use the parts. Extra large. Did they burn the body in here? Well, I don't know. It's a lot of freakiness going on right now. It's a lot of red flags already, for real. Okay, we got this. This was only recently installed, not two days ago. Oh wow. recently installed wow what's on what's, what's on this fridge nothing i already checked all the way out there i feel like do i have all the clues five minutes later all right we got the newspaper let's i guess let's just talk to her bro all right, let's get it. Slaughterhouse receipt. Let's get it. Receipt in the trunk of your husband's car for a live pig. This receipt was made out to an F Morgan. A pig? Adrian runs a tool business. That would be Frank Morgan. Mm. God knows what he's up to. I, I, I think she's telling the truth. What makes you say that about Morgan, ma'am? He's the foreman at my husband's plant. A very shady character. 
I told Adrian he needs to keep his distance from the staff. They're always out drinking together. All right, alibi for Mrs. Black. Let me see. I don't know if I want to ask that yet. Your husband frequents Kavanaugh's bar. How did you know that? Adrian practically lives there after work. I, I believe her. So Adrian spends a lot of time there. Up until recently, he's been away in Seattle a lot on business. Okay, he's been in Seattle on some business where he found a new, a new, a new woman. <laughs> Location of Adrian. All right, let's, let's ask about the glasses. Was your husband wearing his glasses when he left here yesterday? Yes, he just bought a new pair. Okay, I agree. I think she's telling the truth. Go on. Okay, she's doing good so far. I kept telling him to throw those old ones away. He tried to repair them with tape. They look terrible. Uh, photograph signed Nicole. Spicy question. Let's let's ask that. The photo of Adrian in the bedroom. What is there to tell? It's from his most recent business trip to Seattle. Uh, we can ask about. Ooh, we could tell a lie. There's plenty to tell. You just won't tell it. You're lying about the photograph, Mrs. Black. You're incredibly rude and insensitive. But I guess you know that. Mm -hmm. I told you what I know about the picture. Oh, did you? Uh, where is it? Is this concealed message? What about Woo! Mrs. Black? Was your husband going to leave you for her? Oh. Damn. I've seen the photo frame. <laughs> he thinks I'm stupid. But women sense these things. I don't know if he intended to leave me or if it was just the fling. God only knows. I only want to know that he's safe. Okay, we're doing good so far. Two more. Alibi for Mrs. Black. I think you should come clean with us, Mrs. Black. Your husband is missing, and after our search, I'm willing to call the circumstances suspicious. Can you account for your movements last night? You're not accusing me, are you? Oh, what an awful thing to say. I was here all night, of course, waiting for Adrian to come home. Hmm. I don't know. If it's not lied, then it's truth. All right. I don't. She says she was here waiting for him to get home. Uh. She's probably telling the truth. Wait, wait, wait. Live hog purchase receipt signed by F. Morgan found. Was it to her? Well, was it to her? No, I don't want to click it though. Bloody pipe. She, I, uh, the train ticket. No, it's not these glasses case. She says she was here. None of these give me any indication of her being anywhere else. Are you trying to find my husband? Shut up. Let's Is go. Let's tell who can vouch for that? She was telling the truth. Let's go. No. I, I was here alone. I cooked Adrian's dinner and waited. But he never came home. All right. One more. One Did more. Did your husband tell you where he was going last night? All he said was he was going to meet Frank for a drink. I agree. 
I think she's telling the truth. So ooh, 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 we got them all right. Well, he came home early from work. He never comes home early. And he went out early, too. He normally never leaves for the bar till about 7. We'll keep you informed. Let's go. We got them all right. Please do, detective. All right. Now we got to take our asses to the, to the bar. Bro, I was sweating trying to get these questions right. Move. Yo, yo, the, the yo, the end, yo. <laughs> oh, they said hold. They said hold the vehicle. To you make, drive. I need to go over the case notes. Oh yeah, you drive, motherfucker. Since All my right. driving is so Where bad, to? you drive. Jesus, I'm glad to be out of there. Mr. and Mrs. Black. Yes, sir. We're going to skip this shit. I probably should have just let him drive and listen to the dialogue. Oh, too late now. Stars used to preserve daintiness. Hey, I know you. No, you don't. Yes, sir. <laughs> no, you don't. <laughs> Shut his shit down real quick. Looking for someone? Uh, yeah. Should probably talk to, the, talk to the bartender. You know Frank Morgan? Sure. Frank's a regular. He's a loner in the back. This oh, he, he back here. Frank Morgan? Who's asking? Cole Phelps, LAPD. I understand you're a friend of Adrian Black. Yeah, I know him. Are you aware that he's missing? You know him? No, I hadn't heard that. What? No, you sound like you're lying already. Tough break. Oh, wow. You just gonna lie to me like that? I don't want... Whoa. Hold on, hold on. Let me, let me leave him. Thanks. I'm glad we cleared that up. I can't get up? Everything is fine. I mean, there's nothing to really search in here, so link to abandoned vehicle. We found Black's car abandoned in a freight depot, covered in blood. You know anything about that, Morgan? Hell no. Uh, I'm, I'm sorry to hear that. Wow. I like Adrian. He, he's a good no, boss. Please, don't tell me you actually believe this jerk off, Phelps. No, the fuck I don't. Don't, like, relax, relax, partner. He's lying. There's a receipt. You're lying, Morgan. You were there. There's a receipt to You're him. You're talking out your ass, detective. How about you prove I was out at that rail yard? He was, there's a receipt with his name in. Live hog purchase receipt signed by F. Morgan found in an abandoned vehicle. Yeah. You were there, Morgan. Let's get it. We found a receipt in the trunk of the car. It has your name on it. We can call the slaughter yard and nail you on it. All right, already. That fool Adrian's fallen for some dame in Seattle. He wanted me to make it look like he'd been attacked. Oh, wow. So there's... Wow. So he's alive. They just faked this shit. Where exactly is Black holed up? No idea. I think he took off for Seattle. He's lying, but I don't know what... I don't know what to add. I don't know. Lies, lies, and more lies, Morgan. You know where he is. What have you got that says I know where he is? Uh, let me see. Uh. See, wallet. Glasses, bloody pipe, water heater. Train ticket. Uh, uh, damn, I really don't know. He's lying. I, I doubt it, though. I think I'm gonna have to use doubt. There's nothing here. Sorry, my mistake. I'm tired of your shit. Oh, let's go. It was Spill doubt. It. it was doubt. Well, we take you out in the alley and we knock it out of you. Mm. Hold up at my place. He's waiting for some money to come through before he blows town. An address? It's an apartment house at the corner of Temple and Figueroa. Apartment number two. Oh, okay. 
I think that's all. Thanks for your help, Morgan. Yeah, we get wait. We get so hey, good at these I'm interrogations. Just I, could help. I love cops. Cuff him, let him go. It's up to you, Phelps. There's no way I'm writing this idiot up. You want a tip? Do I arrest this guy? Why would I arrest him? There was no murder com co committed. They fake. They fake something, but at the end of the day, I don't think this is anything illegal. Faking your death. I mean, faking your death is is that. A well, they didn't say faked his death. They said fake to make it look like something happened to him. Feel my coffee faster next time. I don't know if I. I don't. I don't think I should arrest this guy. He's only a writer, so. I'm gonna leave. All the same to you. I'll go back to my drink. Uh, waitress. Can I get another spoon? Yeah. There's What's nothing. There was nothing that happened to make the. No, yeah, nothing happened. You can drive. Alright, let's just see what they talk uh, about. Going? Cause he's nobody's dead. So, I mean, hey, I am not, I am not going to that, bro. Let's see what they got to talk about. 11K, go ahead. Bro, he answered the call. He better not be going to that damn, that, that, that damn shit, bro. Alrighty, we're we finally made it to the apartment. It's twelve oh nine p.m. Okay, it's noon. It's early. Damn, they they was out and about early with Let's this. Check the place out. I mean, it just this did get called in early, so they're taking everything, taking care of everything early. Damn, vibrating already. F Morgan. Apartment two. I mean, he did say he was held up here. Right. All right, one through four is this way. He said he's in apartment two. All right, gold handle. Help you, gentlemen. Oh wow! Look LAPD at this dude. detectives, Mr. Black. You're under arrest. Look. I'm really sorry about this. I never tried to hurt anyone. I just needed to get away from LA. I won't put up a struggle. Just let me get my things. Fuck no. I knew it. I, I knew it. After him. Bro, I, I knew it too. Remember, the gun is the last resort. This, this is a big guy. So let's see how fast he really is, bro. There's no point running, Avery. I should not be chasing after him for so long. I knew he was going to do that Get shit, though. Right now. Stop right it's there, over, Adrian. Adrian. Look. Oh, gotta love Adrian. Why not just come clean with her, Black? Why the melodrama? I thought it would be easier. No, it just got a whole lot harder. Adrian Black, you're under arrest for conspiracy and fraud. We'll see what the DA has to say about wasting police resources on a wild goose chase like this. You're gonna oh, lose wow. your wife, lose your job, and probably end up in the big house. Damn. I hope she was worth it, Adrian. All this for some vagina. That's sad. That is so sad, bro. Now that we have to interrogate out to be quite him. some case, huh? Adrian, what an idiot. You got an arrest and a clearance in your first case, and in fine style, too. Well done, detective. Efficient investigation technique, good public presence. You keep that up and you learn from Bukowski here, you could go a long way in this department. I did everything. I don't need to learn shit from this guy. This guy is useless, bro. I don't need him. I can do this shit by myself. Only thing he did was drive. And that's because I made him do it. All right, I found every clue and I only got two questions wrong, bro. Oh, that hurts. This could have been such a perfect case. Adrian Black can look forward to his day in court in a beating from the LA press. I swear, some guys will really sell their souls over vagina, over some vagina, bro. Go out, go out the way, do a lot of dumb stuff all of all for this, bro. You're not happy, get a divorce. Like, what's, what's with the weird shit? Um, 
It's probably going to start me with another case now. Yeah. Um. All right, guys. That is the end of this video. Um. I can't. I can't zoom in because my my mouse is locked to this one screen. I can't go anywhere. But I hope you guys really enjoyed the uh the video. This is a good game. Let me know what you guys think about it. Um. Make sure you guys like and subscribe if you really are enjoying it though. And if you're new. What's good? How you guys doing? I love you guys. See you guys in the next one. Peace.